My hair is not perfect, and we know this. It doesn't matter, uh, right? We don't mind, right? You don't mind. It's cool. You could look at my hairstyle and be like, yeah, this is good. <laughs> don't say anything. But every video I do this, and I wind up adjusting every single video. Not to mention the fact that my makeup table is a complete wreck. It It's, uh, there's a lot going on. Um, I've had a full day so far. Woke up and uh, had to clean up some, Gil got sick, our cat, and had to take care of that immediately. It was, it was delightful. Good morning. And uh, I'm still kind of in sort of PJs. I got these really cute sweats from Target recently for like 22 bucks and they're oversized and they're super comfortable. So I'm practically in pajamas, but not. And uh, it's great. We're gonna play with some makeup today. So I thought it'd be fun to try the Say Slip Tint. I recently picked this up in the Sephora sale that was happening. I said that really well with all the S's and stuff and didn't screw it up. I'm kind of surprised. This got an Allure Award in 2021. So we're gonna give it a shot and see if it rivals my favorite skin tint, which is the Fenty Beauty one. I love this. This is like my favorite. This is my ride or die. I use this like almost every time I do my makeup unless it's a more coverage day, in which case I'll go with my house labs. This is phenomenal too. You have to shake it up a little bit or otherwise it separates. It's the formula. It's got like Arnica or something like that in it, but anyway. So we got this to try today and also the new Pat McGrath bronzer that I did not need but I wanted so badly because I mean I had to have it so I got that and um we're just gonna hang out and play with makeup so if that sounds like fun stick around because I'm about to get into it but before I do if you haven't already you know the drill like subscribe come hang out on my channel it'd be really great to have you here and with that being said all of that being said <laughs> let's get into today's video Gil has arrived. He has made his entrance. The closet door is open so he can get in there without any trouble. You will hear a noise. It's not a lot I can do about it. He is, um, he is frisky today. He got a little sick this morning, but he's not acting sick. I think it was a hairball. Kind of weird because he's already been, he just got groomed. I don't know what the heck's going on. You know, it, I'm a cat mom and I love my boy so much. And, um, yeah, so he's hydrated. He's good. And he's very active. And he's in the room with us today. So what are we playing with today? This new say, no, sort of new, new to me, slip tint. I love a good skin tint, you know. And this is in the shade 3.5, that is correct. And it was the last one. When I was looking online, this is the one that was closest to my skin tone match or whatever. And uh, I was really excited because I was able to find it in store. So let me just put a little on the back of my hand and see if, how we feel about the color. I'm, I'm pretty sure this is my skin tone out of all of them, and they have a pretty decent range, if I'm not mistaken, nothing's coming out. Okay, here we go. Yeah, that's gonna work perfectly. Okay, okay, rub it in a little bit. Hmm, I don't know. Let's see if we like it, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on my face. So I, let me put my hair up really quick, and we'll slap this on and see how, how it plays on our skin, so. Let me do that and I'll be right back. So I went ahead and grabbed my headband. It was in the other room. So we're hair up and ready to go. I did my skin prep and all that stuff. I'm using that, what do you call it? The night mask from Laneige as just regular moisturizer. And I love it. it as a night mask, it's a pass for me. I need something a lot more heavy duty, especially these days for this, uh, this aged skin. Gil left the room and now he's playing in something. Um, what was I saying? I can't even remember. Oh my God, help me. Okay, so I'm fully moisturized. I am gonna go ahead and buy that. I'm gonna get like the full size because I actually really do like it. But um, you know, it's it's doing the thing for, for the daytime and for a night mask, I'll have to pick something else. Let me know if you know of anything recommended as a good night mask, what you think would be good. Honey, come on, we're in here, we're, we're hanging out. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get into this. I've rambled enough. Here it is, the Say. I, I did a little swatch on the back of my hand. I don't know, we're gonna see how it works on the face. So let's just go ahead and get started before I go off on a whole different tangent, which we know I probably will do. So here we go, <laughs> quickly, before I start thinking of something else. All right, let's try it. I mean, the consistency is, is like moisturizer. It's pretty thick. Look at that, that's odd. Not what I would expect. This feels like skincare because it is. Wow, is there any, oh, look at that. I just got it big time under my eye. What the hell is happening? It is so thick, oh my God. 
Hang on. What? Hey, I don't want to lose any of it because, okay, crisis averted. <laughs> what is happening on my, <laughs> what is happening? Okay, let's get a little more. Does this, I think this has SPF in it. Does it? I'm going to have to check and see. Does this have the spiff? Oh my God, it's in my hair. <laughs> what the hell is happening? Does it have SPF? <laughs> so bad. Oh no. Okay, I'm going to handle it. I'm going to take care of it. It's all right. Look, it blends in beautifully. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my God, are you joking? I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Oh no. Oh, damn it. Okay, maybe, I, am I doing it wrong? Hang on, hold on. Forget the sponge. Let me just grab the product here and just put it on my phalanges. Yeah. <laughs> All right, um, it's uh, it's it's nice as far as moisturizer goes. It's very moisturizing. I have a ton of this on my face right now. It's literally just sitting on top of my skin. But um, what I was saying before I started putting it on is that when I put it on the back of my hand, it it dried pretty quickly. It like absorbed or evaporated, whatever. It did the thing pretty quickly and. Um, it, it does feel still a little moisturized on the back of my hand, but it's not, I don't know. Um, it feels kind of heavy right now, probably because I have a lot on, but I thought, I thought it was gonna be more, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> the coverage is not there. Um, not at all, but it, it's nice. As far as moisturizer goes, it's, it's sitting on my skin and it is very moisturizing. I can see this as like a skin prep, absolutely, right off the bat. So let me go ahead and grab a little concealer and I'm going to spot, you know, and just kind of handle that that way. And then we'll move on to the bronzer and we'll just keep the party going. I, I didn't read up on it. I just saw that it had, you know, some awards and stuff. And I thought, well, let me just handle my redness a little bit here because I am a little red and I have a, a little melasma still. Um, that's when you go through the hormonal change, if you don't know. <laughs> For those who don't know, that's what happens sometimes. You get what they call a pregnancy mask if your hormones are out of balance and you get dark patches all over your face. And I have that because I just do. It kind of, it runs in my family. And I think I got it worst out of everybody. My mom and my sister had it, but very mild compared to what I had. And it's only in the past few years started to go away. Um, and, uh, there's still little bits here and there. So that's what I usually like to cover just to even out my skin tone. You know, like, like we all do when we use a foundation or skin tint of any kind. You can see I recently shaved my peach fuzz. So, um, it's, this is it. So this is the bronzer. Oh my God. I love it. I think it's in the shade Dawn, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure that's the name of it. I can't read without my glasses. We're gonna say it is, um, and it's gorgeous, and I'm gonna go ahead and use that and bronze up my face a little bit, because I need some more life going on. I'm feeling very, um, <laughs> I'm feeling lots of feelings right now, and I, I'm, yeah, I, I don't know. We're, we're gonna talk about it, but let's try the bronzer and see how that goes. Oh, that's a pretty shade, look at that. Wow. And my skin is still a little tacky, so I'm hoping that this doesn't patch up because that would make me very sad. I'm in a great mood because life is good. And I just did, you guys, I don't know, you'll probably already see it by the time this video goes up, but I did the cutest freaking video of Gilbert. <laughs> I made him a uh, McDonald's employee and I, I'm gonna post it on shorts or it's gonna already be posted on shorts. And he's just so cute and I just love our cat so much. He's such a precious little boy. So we've already uh, had a full morning. Gil and I were spending time together and I'm working on Wednesday and you know, we're gonna be in downtown LA, wish me luck. Uh, but yeah, Gilly and I are hanging out and I just thought it'd be fun to sit down and kind of play with makeup, I guess. I mean, <laughs> guess you can call it that. It's just red this under here. It's I know it's a bronzer. It'd be better if I used a contour for this for shadow, but mm, I'm still gonna use it because this is what I have to work with today. 
um, the tail end of what I purchased during the sale. I didn't get anything else because this was pretty much all that I wanted at the moment. And um, oh, I will say that I recently did that thing I was telling you guys about that I do every now and again and added stuff to my Sephora basket and then logged out. <laughs> so I did that, you know, like dream shopping just for fun. There's, there's some things that I'd like to have, but you know, right now it's, it's just not necessary and didn't seem like a good idea, like financially. So, um, so I didn't, you know, I'm just going to tap that out underneath a little bit, but this bronzer is beautiful. It's, it's, it's so lovely and pigmented. I really like it. This is nice. I want to make sure that I I just looked to the side and it looked like I didn't blend it well enough, but no, 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 that's good. It's, it's fine. Okay. Cause sometimes the lights will fool me and I'll think it, um, it's done and then I'll go to look at it in like regular lighting and it's like, what the hell happened? How did I miss that? So, you know, it also happens cause we're all, I'm sitting here having fun and hanging out with you guys and I'm just like not paying attention. I mean, just do the rest of my, you know, face and, or maybe I'll I mean, I don't really have a lot of stories. Otherwise, I would stay on, but I'm not going to do anything that's really that different. I think I'm going to use, like, I guess I'll stay on a couple of minutes. I don't know what the hell. I'm just all over the place. I'm shocked. I'm shocked. And I'm, I'm going to use my blush from Pat McGrath, too, the, the more, like, nude one. May as well, you know, keep up with whatever. So let's hop into that really quick. And I'm just so surprised. I had a completely different expectation of what was going to go down today with this. So I'm, I'm trying to like get my thoughts straight. I'm, I'm a little, um, yeah, I, I'm like that. So that's why. So let me just <laughs> finish the rest of this and I'll hop back on and we'll, let me just collect my thoughts. Cause I'm just like, does not compute. I'm like having a moment. What a horrible, horrible nightmare. <laughs> I no, 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 no. Hang on. I let me just. I gotta look at this. I I just feel like something is not right. Hyaluronic acid helps to attract water and retain moisture. Okay, this is a tinted moisturizer that offers skin-loving hydration with sheer dewy coverage. Yeah, this is a me thing. This is where I screwed up. In confusion-free shades, that I wouldn't say that. Uh, 100% mineral UV protection, so it does have the spiff in it. How much though? It doesn't say. At least not here. It's a liquid formula, hydrating, light coverage, light coverage. Yeah, but even light coverage, listen, this to me, okay, well, this is, this is the finished look. Let me just go into that. This is it. And it's, my skin looks nice. I think um, I didn't add anything else. This is the what you guys saw with the blush and and all that. That's it. A little bit of mascara and I, you know, and scene. That's we're we're done. So we're gonna talk about this. <laughs> I don't know why I was thinking. I know they have a foundation out. I know, and I I didn't get that one. I wanted to try the skin tint because I've been really into skin tints lately. I mean, that's been like my jam. I love a good skin tint. This is not going to replace this. Not even a little. This is a great skin tint and it has a lot of coverage. It'll, not a lot, but it'll certainly give you coverage. This is doing nothing. If you look closely, you can see um, my skin is, it's just peeking through. This is a moisturizer and it's a weird smelling one. I don't even like the smell. I don't know how it got no more. I mean, it, I, I, people like it. I don't know. I, I don't want to be, I don't want to bag on it. Obviously, this is a first impression, and it's hard to go off of a first impression. I got to try it a couple more times, unfortunately, <laughs> before I can decide how I really, really feel about it. But first impression-wise, let's let's take my mistake out of the equation um, because I feel like most people, especially these days, skin tints are like stepping it up, and they're not. I mean, yes, they're light coverage, but they're doing a little bit of coverage where this is not it's it's definitely not it is thick um it, it's it's a moisturizer i feel like if i were to use this it would be more of a yeah like a skin prep which we all know i don't really do or maybe like a finishing if i wanted to but i feel like it would disturb my moisturize my my foundation or whatever if i did it over my foundation so i'm not really sure i guess as a prep let's just say in a perfect world i prep my skin this and uh maybe not even then because i right i really don't like the smell um, I don't know what it is, um, but I, I don't. And the feel of it, once it dries down, it's not that bad, but I do feel like 
maybe because there's so much on my face right now, that's why it feels still so kind of sticky and tacky. Um, I guess if I set it, but what am I setting? It's like my, <laughs> so I'm setting moisturizer. That's weird. <laughs> it, doesn't make, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. It's like, please make it make sense. I don't understand. Um, they say that it's really easy to match your skin tone. And, and it wasn't for me. I feel like I kind of struggled a little bit to match my skin tone. Um, but um, what are you really matching? I mean, I'm, it's it's so light. So I guess that would be true because there's no pigment. So um, so that's this. And it did get an award. So a lot of people really like it. Uh, it's got 4.4 stars. People rave about it. They love it. Um, I guess I'm the odd man out because I'm, I'm just not feeling it. I mean, my skin doesn't look terrible. Don't get me wrong. It, it looks fine. It's just... Um, I don't know. I, you know, I don't know. I'm gonna have to, like I said, I'll try it a couple times and try and give it a, but I, I, yeah, I literally, I had to stop and like think about it for a second. And, like, let me just look on the, let me just read and, you know, kind of try and soak up a little knowledge and get myself like, you know, set proper so I can sit down and like have some kind of, I don't know what the hell, <laughs> I don't know what to make of it. Just, it's like a funny smelling moisturizer at this point as far as I'm concerned and it makes my skin feel sticky. And let me know what you think in the comments. Um, how, how Do you like it? I mean, do you, I mean, <laughs> help me. <laughs> so let's go into this one, the bronzer. No surprise. I, I love it. It's beautiful. I, I can't wait to, um, I, I'm going to wash my face right after this. Actually, I'm really looking forward to washing my face. <laughs> Um, I'm very excited about it, but next time around, I'm really looking forward to using this. The pigmentation in this is beautiful. I love it. I got the perfect shade for me. That uh, concealer, the Fenty concealer, creases horribly on me. I can, I can see it. So let me lean back a little bit so I don't scare you guys. I love the bronzer. It's great. The finish look, I mean, on camera with the lights and stuff, it looks nice, but um, it's just not. It's not doing anything for me. I, I wish... That I liked it more. It's kind of unfortunate. I, I had high hopes for it, but um, like I said, I'm going to try it a couple more times and see how it goes, you know, especially knowing now how it works and stuff like that. I'm sure I'll be able to find a way to like finagle it or give it away. <laughs> I'm glad that I got to try it and sit down and share it with you guys. And I look forward to talking about it in the comments and hopefully somewhere in this video, you know, I, I made you laugh or you were laughing with me because you know, I, I was cracking up. I didn't know what to do. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm glad I got to try it. Like I said, glad I got to hang out with you guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. And um, <laughs> it's going to do it for me today, kids. Thank you so much for sticking around and watching. As always, I really do appreciate it. And I will catch you all in the next one. Bye.